If you ever see a quarter on a headstone, don't touch it. Many people go to the cemetery several times a year to honor their loved ones, and many people come on the deceased's birthday, public holidays, or the anniversary of his death. Of course, these trips to the cemetery can be bittersweet. It feels good to visit your loved one and even be able to talk to him, but those trips to the cemetery can also be sad. When visiting a loved one in the cemetery, it is not uncommon to see change. In addition to headstones, you may have seen someone do this on TV or in the movies. Now, if you ever see a coin or some other coin on a tombstone, leave it there, and there's a reason people do that. A man named Dave Malenfant. He works at the Holly M.I. National Military Cemetery while working at the cemetery. He saw countless families come to pay tribute, respect and mourn their loved ones, and he noted that when people came to pay tribute, they left change on the headstones of their loved ones. While he knew it was meant to let the family know that someone had visited the site, he wasn't sure each piece had any meaning. As he walked through the cemetery, he noticed that some tombstones had only quarters, others only dimes, and so on. He also noted that many tombstones had a variety of coins, so he was interested in getting to the bottom of the mystery. So one day after work he decided to do some research. No one knows for sure how this tradition fares. Again, however, it is believed to have gained popularity during the Vietnam War. During this time, there was political division in the country over the war. Some thought what the EUS was doing in Vietnam was the right thing to do, while others were completely against it. They didn't think it was fair for Americans to die in a war that we shouldn't have been involved in in any way by leaving behind coins. It was a way of loving the soldiers. Know that you would comply. It was more convenient than contacting their family, and it prevented. Inconvenient arguments about the politics and controversy of war. People started leaving the coins to commemorate those who sacrificed their lives for our country and our freedom. Dave got to the bottom of the mystery, but he still didn't know the relevance of each piece. He first checked the websites for all military branches, but found nothing. After doing some more research, he found that while the US military has no official policy recognizing this practice, there is a certain protocol. Have people follow as to the coins on the tombstones. If you want to show your respect to a fallen soldier, leave a dime. If you trained in a training camp with the deceased, leave a dime on the tombstone. When you have served with the deceased, leave a dime. If you were there when the soldier was killed, you would be leaving a corner. Leaving a coin on the grave of a fallen soldier is a powerful gesture for the family of soldiers, based on today's research, it means a lot that you don't even have to know the soldier personally to show your respect by leaving a penny in the grave. Leaving a fallen soldier behind is a strong gesture for the family of soldiers. That means a lot. It shows them that his loved one has been a big part of people's lives and that the soldiers crossing the cemetery will miss them. It means a lot based on today's research, you don't even have to meet the soldier in person to show your respect by leaving a penny. We should all be grateful for our fallen soldiers currently on duty or retired. America wouldn't be there without them. Wonderful places today. When Dave learned the meaning of the coins, he was excited. Says he's trying to put pennies on some headstones. Every time he works, even though he has never served in the army, he would like to thank those who, according to the family, buried the fallen soldiers in the cemetery. It is a great feeling to see the coins on the tombstone of loved ones. Subscribe for more videos.